everyone welcome back to my channel or if you are new here hi today's video is going to be me reorganizing my bookshelves this is the current situation and i'm out of room i've got books like sitting on top of the other books and i just need to reorganize this i did get quite a few new books for my birthday and for Christmas, I got all these for Christmas. My boyfriend got me the whole Like Us series. I've been buying books too, so I'm just out of room. So I need to figure out something so I'm able to fit them all on my bookshelves. I'm pretty sure I vlogged it, but my dad added this side for me. I used to only have this one side and I ran out of room, so he built this. And I would have him add more, but I really don't have like anywhere else to add one. I do have these which I need to keep right here. I bought these because I have these shelves right above my nightstand and so I have like my Chanel and Elements of Style book and I was thinking of putting like the Louis Vuitton book up by my Louis Vuitton box and the Gucci by the Gucci but these shelves are from Amazon and they're really flimsy and they can hardly handle the weight of these books so there's no way that those other books could fit up there. Right now I just have nowhere else to put them. So I need to keep them here because it has the support of the shelf and of my Alex drawers. I do have a bookshelf out in my hallway which has a lot of my like YA books. Books I read in like middle school and high school, my Harry Potter books, stuff like that. And so I think all my like YA books that I have right here, I'm going to try to stick on that shelf out there. My room also behind me is an absolute mess. I'm trying to like declutter my whole entire life because I do plan on getting a house this year and moving out. And so I want to try to get rid of as much stuff as I can. So before I move, I don't have as much stuff to pack and take with me. So that's what I'm in the process of doing. I'm also going to film a video soon of me going through all my Alex drawers and decluttering. Like these are filled with like my makeup and stuff. And I really don't wear makeup. If you watch my older videos, you know I was always posting like makeup videos. And I have so many like makeup palettes. But I just am not into that anymore. So definitely... Be on the watch for that because i'm gonna be going through and throwing so much away because it's old and gross and i don't use it and it's not safe to give to other people i want to show you guys this before i start taking all my books down i did start a bookstagram account last night this is what it is it's just be read so if you want to go follow me you definitely can i'm going to try to post as much on here as i can i'll have it linked down below too i did just clean off my desk this morning and so I think I'm just going to take all my books down besides this top part because I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep it how it is. So I got the first shelf cleared off. I'm going to put both of my Jenny Han series out in the bookshelf because those take up a pretty good chunk of room. So the summer I turned pretty and to all the boys I loved before, they are going to go away, out in the hallway. What I've done so far is I put all my Addicted Calloway Sister and then like a series right here and then I put the Briar You and Off Campus right here. I don't think I like it. I think I liked it better when this was on this side and these were down. So I think I'm going to remove all these down and put these back right here and then the rest of the space I have down here like I have a few series right here that I might put on the back side right there. I don't know. We'll see how it looks. I just, I'm not a fan of this. This is what it looks like now. I put all the addicted back. And then I did with the Stay With Me series by Nicole Fiorina, I think is how you say it. And then Paper Princess by Aaron Watt. And then over here, I did Aiden and Amelia, which I did not really like this series. So I kind of want to get rid of it. I don't really know. And I haven't read these yet. I know there's a third one, maybe even a fourth. But I put those here. This series, Miles High. And then my L. Kennedy. I just don't know. 
I feel like the elk candy need to go down because then it'll be lined with my rainbow shell. And I feel like that will be pretty. So I'm thinking maybe move these down and then I can put my off balance up so it sticks with kind of like the darker theme. Maybe I'll see how I like that. makeup on and I've not been sleeping good at night <laughs> my eye bags are so bad ignore that but I'm just kind of stuck I don't know what to do and this lighting is making me look so red I don't feel like standing up so I'm just gonna sit here and show you I continued my colors going around here I think I like it and then up there I did my white series into the black series which is okay. I like how these are all together. I wish they had better matching covers. And I do like how it's colorful, neutral, colorful, and then these are going to be like black. But my issue is I still have all these books. I have all these still right here. I feel like I'm going to have to put some books right here because all my white books are not going to fit right here. Unless I move my twilight out into the hallway and then I can put some of my black books up top that I'm not gonna like it because they're not gonna be the same height as my hardcover books. I think I'm just gonna sit here a little bit and go on my phone and this is so cute. One of my favorite accounts. I've been following her on like my real Instagram for such a long time. This is her page but she I posted in here about how Easton like supports me and all my stuff. Where did the comment go? Oh it's down here and she goes we love supportive man so brownie points to Easton. <laughs> I texted it to him, but he hasn't replied yet, but I've been getting so much support and I love it So cute and Ray Ray reads just one of my favorite booktubers posted this on her story. So love that. I just love it I have two new messages <gasps> Did she <gasps> she put me on her story. Oh my god. I am just like Fangirling. Oh my god. I don't think I've like Really fangirled as much <laughs> as I have today. <laughs> I need to add this to my story. Okay, I can't do this through the screen of my camera. So I'm gonna go add this to my story and uh, update you guys when I figure out what I'm gonna do with this mess. So this is all I have left to put up, but I still don't like it. Like I could set them right there, but I don't want them right there. So I don't, I don't know. So I'm on my phone right now scrolling through the hashtag shelfie to see what other people have done with their bookshelves. I wish I could do some where they're like facing out like that, but like I just don't have the room for that. Like that's cute, like they're not really color coded, but I feel like I need to color code in mine, otherwise it's gonna bother me. Wish I lived on a house where I could have like huge bookshelves and have endless room so I could make it aesthetically pretty, but I don't have that yet. So these are all the books that I decided to take off my shelf. A lot of these are like YA, that's a Christmas one, YA, YA, that's a thriller, it just didn't really fit in anywhere so I moved it. And then this I got at Sam's Club, I don't know if I'm ever going to read it, I don't know. So I just moved it, it's a summer book, if I'm reading it it's going to be in the summer. So now I'm really liking how it looks, I love this color going on. But now I have a big gap right here, which I do have this candle my friend Mariah asked me to be a bridesmaid with that I had up there before, and I also have this fake plant. So I could, like, put the plant somewhere. So maybe, well, I could put that red one next to that red one. I might hate this, though. This is one of my mom's books. She reads, like, thrillers, and she reads in the bath. So this one has, like, water damage. But I want to read it, so... It's up here. Okay, then let's move this red one here. Shit. Okay. Scoot these all down. I don't know. I don't like how it goes from 
light than black. I feel like I'm gonna have to move these. I want her to keep my 50 shades and my beard to you in the back. So I think I want to move all these and put them maybe like in between here and scoot it all down. Okay, I'm gonna do that and see how that looks. Okay, I think this is just how I'm gonna end it for the day. Quick overview, I'm gonna do a bookshelf tour, not in this video, hopefully soon though. But up top I have after the Dirty Air series, Pretty Little Liars, and then I have a few of my taller books back there. I have the Full Tilt and All In duet and then The Kiss Thief by LJ Shen. I hate that book and I don't like her as an author, so I stuck her in the way back corner so I don't have to look at it. And then I got Twilight, all of my hardcover books. And then going around here, I've got the Addicted Callaway Sisters series. I have them split up by the Addicted and Callaway because I like how these ones all look together, but you read them like intertwined. And then Whatever It Takes duet, Like Us series, Stay With Me, Paper Princess, Twisted Love, Twisted Games. I'm in the middle of reading Twisted Games. You can see my bookmark. I'm also in the reading Some Kind of Perfect. The Aiden and Amelia. Beautiful Disaster, Priest Center Saint, Miles High, Off Balance. And then we go to my Colorful, all the way over. And then in here I have all of my bookmarks. I get most of my bookmarks from KT Canvas. I can link her site down below. I love them. They're so sturdy. There's so many different ones. They're so cute. And then I have a few of my other ones. I went to the Amazon bookstore. So I have that. Barnes & Noble one. I <laughs> have... I used to use this as a bookmark. It's a senior picture of myself. <laughs> and then my blue light glasses for like, when I edit and stuff. And then all my black into some red into the neutrals. Then these giant books that cannot go anywhere else because they weigh a thousand pounds. Then I have my Gilmore Girl candles up here. I smell snow and starts hollow. I like how the blue goes with the blue and then this one like matches with that. Cute. And then I have my candle. I just have it turned around because... I don't know. I should have it to the front because it's really cute, but I like how this matches with the little potted plant, which I got this at Target in the dollar section a little bit ago, so they probably still have some. And then my white little tray, which I'm going to move out a little bit. That is what we got going on. found this as I was cleaning my shelf. It was on top of a book, but it's a Midwest Indie Bookstore Roadmap, and I got it from my local bookstore let me open it here real quick it has list out in our directory all of the bookstores in like the midwest and then like a map of all of them so like twin cities that's minneapolis so that's probably the closest that i would be but in north dakota we have bismarck which you can see ferguson that's where i got this map where i go there's also one in fargo and grand forks this thing's so cool i love going to small bookstores so Super cute. If you live in any of these places or visiting and want me to send you a picture of where they are and their address, I can definitely do that. So I think I'm just going to stick this back here just so I have it in a safe spot. I'm just going to end this video here. I need to clean the rest of my room now. I would show you guys, but I'm literally embarrassed. So we're not gonna you're not gonna see it today. Thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video if you want a book shelf tour Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already I have a few bookish videos planned out my youtube schedule right now is i'm thinking a new video every two weeks Which sounds not that good, but I work full-time and I just Don't have time to film like I used to hopefully though as the year goes on, I get better with managing my YouTube and work schedule. Thanks again for watching. Go follow my Bookstagram account. I'll put it here on the screen. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.